This is your mastery coach, Kettlebell Lady of Iron with Kettlebell Plus 360. Now you use your imagination and use what you have. I'm clipping a 175 pound tractor tire using a sandbag, battling rope, and kettlebells. And this not forget the sledgehammer. When you're beating with the sledgehammer or anything overhead, make sure you have those shoulders locked solid in their sockets. Use your whole body and get that movement going for efficiency and safety. Okay, that looks good. Now make sure that you're warmed up and see this is an excellent way to help balance coordination with a weight that's heavy and to be able to turn it and flip it. It's all about leverage, hip hinge, ground the feet, breathe deep. And when you are leveraging something that weighs more than you, make sure you're using your hips, not your biceps, because that will rip them up. It's learning how to hip hinge, ground the feet, squat, and get that knee underneath that heavy weight to help flip it. Now check the posture. I am solid, I am using a strength under tension, and I'm breathing really deep. Now I'm going to beat this tire with a sledgehammer. Make sure that you have that sledgehammer held correctly and your body is locked. And I see I got one arm at the lower and the upper. Now I'm doing some mountain climbers and some push-ups and get a good full body workout. Or you can use that hammer good, can't you? I sure can. Just watch out. Just have fun with it and go to the length that your body is able, but not to overwork it. Okay, that was good. Now we're going to do a military press. It's real good and safe. If you lock that shoulder in, rotate, corkscrew it, pull it down with the lats. Breathe really deep, and that's movement under tension. Now I'm shaking out all that tension before I go to the other side. Clean it, press it, pull it down. And I'm using my lats when I pull it down. And breathe really, really deep and punch and breathe out on the way up and breathe in on the way down. Clean it, press it, punch it up, pull it down. Breathe deep and inhale on the way down. Breathe under tension. Make sure you take rest breaks and this is high interval training so you can have a minute on, 15, 30 second rest if you get tired set it down and there's always another day now i'm going to work with a sandbag but you can use a bag of pet food anything you have on hand and it's a great way to move that body in multiple directions i'm doing a squat roll and i'm tossing it up and bringing it down and I'm having fun, and that's the important thing. Whatever you do, have fun when you're exercising. Now I have my feet locked, and I have control of that weight because my 
total body is locked up under tension in a know when to breathe in and when to relax. And it's important that you know how to pick up odd, uneven objects safely to avoid injury. That's what this is all about. So it's kind of like going to the grocery store and picking something off the bottom shelf, huh? That is correct. And you see I'm doing a lot of hip hinging. Do you have your body under tension while you're doing this? Yes, it's always under tension. And I'm breathing really, really deep. And now I'm going to battle the rope. This is often used for rehab because it's low tension. It gets that cardio up. You burn the calories and the fat. And you can do a wide variety of exercises with this rope. You can do it singly, ropes together, squats, lunges. You name it, you can do it. And skaters lunge and you just have fun seeing if you can tame that rope. And if you don't have a battling rope, you can use the jump rope or just your body weight. Okay, you can start off. Now I have those feet anchored and my shoulders are locked solid in the sockets. I'm using my lats and my abs, and I'm getting a total body workout plus cardio. It's a fun way to burn calories and get the benefits of it all day long. Boy, that was a fun workout today, huh? Oh, wow. I like working with a variety of tools. This is your mastery coach, Kettlebell Lady of Iron plus 360. How was that for mixing it up? Use your imagination if you didn't have the tools I have. Have fun with it. You did a great job. And thanks for watching. Until next time.